Hey Patrice, hey Rondrell, I'm outside the Vigo County Government Annex, which will be one of the polling locations available to voters in this upcoming spring's election. I know both state and local officials are hoping to see more people at the polls. Low voter turnout is an issue across the state. Indiana lawmakers are aware of this issue. Now, there's new legislation to help educate more students about voting. I spoke with Matthew Bergbauer, a political science professor at Indiana State University. He says that educating future voters is vital for our system to work like it should. I, I like it being prioritized. I like it and emphasized um, the importance of good citizenship uh, at a young age and then carrying through on that good citizenship throughout your life. Uh, I think it's valuable. So Bergbauer says that once young people go to the polls, they keep coming back. Uh, voting is habitual. So in, in the sense of if you vote as a young person, right, the 18-year-old, the 20-year-old, if you vote, uh, you're more likely to do it again. I spoke with Vigo County Commissioner Chris Schweitzer. He's running for re-election this year. He says that voting in local elections is very important. Yeah, you know, federal government's important because you have a lot of things going on at the national level, but the opportunity to be here with people locally and choose who to best represent you is as important as, as the national government. And this is your first role of defense when things are happening at the state level. and. Early voting here in Vigo County will open up on April 9th. Reporting live from Terre Haute, Ben Verbanek, News 10. Indiana.